So over here on the download page, you can either click over here and just download it to your computer, and then you could upload it through this process of going to upload and browsing your files, or if you want to limit the in-between. So the easiest trick when it comes to downloading Ubuntu is going to be we're over here on Ubuntu 24 LTS, so that's long-term support. I'm going to click the green download button. It's going to pop up that it's downloading, and I'm going to cancel it. And then over here, you're going to have the Get Download Now link over here. So we can just right-click, copy link. We're going to come back to Proxmox, and in our local disk and the ISO images again, we can click Download from URL. I get pasted in here. We're going to query it, and now you can see it sees it, and we're going to download it. So this is just going to download the ISO straight from the site to our Ubuntu server. Depending on how big the ISO is, it might take a little bit longer. This one's not too big, so I'll give it a minute or so, and we should be right back. And when it's all done downloading, we'll see task OK down here at the bottom. This is going to be standard to any operation that's going in Proxmox. So now this is all done, we can close this out. Now you can see we have our server ISO image, and we're set to pretty much start building our first VM. So one thing you might want to do is just see what kind of system requirements the OS has. 